what is innovation of suffering? And for some Dhamma Chaka Posak Bodhana Sutta, the wheel, Dhamma wheel turning in, turning in motion Sutta. Buddha says, Sankhi Dina Vichu Bhadana Khanda Dhoka, in brief, high clinging aggregates of Dhoka Sutta, the noble truth of suffering. What are high clinging aggregates? The clinging aggregate of materiality, the clinging aggregate of feeling, the clinging aggregate of perception, the clinging aggregate of formations, and the clinging aggregate of consciousness. These are five clinging aggregates. The clinging aggregate of materiality is materiality, Rupa. The clinging aggregate of feeling, perception, Formations and consciousness are mentality aggregates. They are called mentality nama. So, five clinging aggregates and nama rupa, mentality and materiality are same meaning. What is rupa? What is nama? What is materiality? What is mentality? We must know. The meaning of vipassana is investigating our body and mind. Our body is composed with subatomic small particles called kalapas. What are kalapas? Maybe they translate very closely subatomic particles. These kalapas are not ultimate materiality. This is the smallest group of materiality. Many Westerners, they don't want to accept Kalapas. Their reason is, Buddha never teach and served us about Kalapas. I want to ask you one question. There are two words. United Kingdom. This is one word. England. This is Another word. These two words have same meaning or different meaning. Sorry, what was the word? United Kingdom. United Kingdom. This and is number one. Yes. Number two is England. <laughs> United Kingdom and UK. Do you understand? <laughs> yeah, it yes. Have same same meaning. The same meaning. In the same way, Maharam Loa that subject. I do with and consulta and a bit more I do with and Buddha says six element meditation. What are six element meditation? Number one, up element. Number two, water element. Number three, higher element. Number four, wind element. Number five, space element, Akasa Tati. Number six, Vinyana element, consciousness element. Among six elements, number five is Akasa Tati, space element. What is space element? After four elements, water, fire, and wind, both are teach space element. According to Abhidhamma, Art, water, fire, and wind. These are four elements. They are great Mahabuddha, great elements. After teaching these four elements, Buddha again teach Akasa Dhatu Space Element. What is the meaning? The meaning is four. Elements are primary elements. And they are all together in the Mount Sangani in, in the Buddha Mount and teach 28 types of rupa, 28 types of materiality. After teaching four elements, these primary elements, 
Then there are 24 tyrant weighted materialities. Tyrant weighted materialities in Bali are called Upata Rupa. Among tyrant weighted materialities, both are teach only one, Akasa Tattoo Space Element. Space Element is one of the 24 tyrant weighted materialities. What is space? Kalabandra Rupa. Kalabandra Parikshita Rupa. This is the definition of the space element. What is the meaning? There are Kalabas, <coughs> subatomic particles. Kalabandra means borderline of these Kalabas. Borderline of these Kalabas are called space element. Although Buddha does not say Kalapa, but he teach space element. The meaning of space element is you must try to see the borderline of Kalapas. Buddha does not teach directly by name Kalapa, but he teach space element. Space, the meaning of space element is the borderline of space between Kalapas. So, today I want to explain a little bit more. Hmm? If you want to see this space for the line of Kalabas, how you should practice? You must practice four elements meditation. But you should remember, United Kingdom and England, they have the same meaning. So, you must practice four elements meditation if you want to see this space element. What are four elements? Earth element, water element, fire element, and wind element. What is earth element? According to the Mark Singhani, there are six characteristics in earth element. Hardness, roughness, heaviness, softness, smoothness, and lightness. So these are earth element. There are two characteristics in water element, flowing and cohesion. There are two characteristics in fire element, heat and coldness. There are also two characteristics in wind element, pushing and supporting. So if a meditator wants to practice these four elements meditation, one must discern this altogether 12 characteristics. I will repeat again. Hardness, roughness, heaviness. Softness, smoothness, lightness. Flowing, cohesion. Heat and coldness. Supporting and pushing. Altogether, there are 12 characteristics. So these 12 characteristics you must try to discern throughout your body from head to foot. If you can discern this dual characteristic from head to foot very, very quickly, then you must try to overview these dual characteristics. While overviewing the whole body, if you see these dual characteristics very, very quickly, then you can discern four groups. Seeing hardness, roughness, heaviness, softness, smoothness, and lightness. You must pay attention, this is an element. Seeing flowing in cohesion. You must pay attention, these are water elements. Seeing heat and coldness. You must pay attention, these are fire elements. Seeing pushing in Supporting, supporting and pushing. You should pay attention, these are weight elements. You must concentrate on these four elements object. If you can concentrate more than one hour every second, then very soon you will see your whole body become transparent body. You can see the whole body begin transparent like ice block. Why this body become transparent? 
Gaudi Lu Buddha's teaching there are quite transparent, rupas, pasada rupas. Eye transparency, ear transparency, nose transparency, tongue transparency, body transparency. So, eye transparency is in your eye. Ear transparency is inside your ear. Nose transparency is inside your nose. Tongue transparency is inside your tongue. But body transparency is through of your whole body. Everywhere if you touch, you can feel the change sensation. If you feel the change sensation everywhere, then everywhere there is body transparency. Why they are called transparency? Yakadi in cha we dan Ruba Dina Ghana Bhavina Ruba Dina Ghana Bichya Bhavina Ada Satalam Wiya Vipasana Ta Pasada Rupa. This is the definition given in Visodhi Maga about the purification. But I will explain the meaning. They are quite transparent robust materialities. I will repeat again, okay? eye transparency, ear transparency, nose transparency, tongue transparency, and body transparency. Eye transparency is the base for eye consciousness, which sees color. Ear transparency is the base for ear consciousness, which hear sound. Nose transparency is the base or nose consciousness, which free smile. Tongue transparency is the base for tongue consciousness, which free the taste. Body transparency is the base for body consciousness, which free tangible object. So they are base cause. They are base cause means rest for respective consciousness. If there is no eye, no eye transparency, eye consciousness cannot rise. If there is eye transparency, other than only eye consciousness can rise. In the same way, if there is ear transparency, ear consciousness can rise. To be there more, ear transparency. At that time only, one can hear some. In the same way, if there is nose transparency, then nose consciousness can rise to be there on nose transparency. At that time, nose transparency can free smell. If there is tongue transparency, this is the base of tongue consciousness. Tongue consciousness rise to be there on tongue base. Then consciousness feels the taste. If there is body transparency, <coughs> body consciousness rise to be the own body transparency. Body, body consciousness can be the general object. So if there is no eye transparency, eye consciousness cannot rise. If eye consciousness cannot rise, then one cannot see color. In the same way, other transparencies are also usually understood in the same way. My meaning is here, they are transparent like mirror, so they are called transparent rupas. If you practice four elements meditation systematically, when your concentration deep becomes deep enough, then you can see this transparent body throughout your body because Throughout your body, everywhere there is body transparency. You can see transparent body like ice block because you cannot see space element. If you do not see space element, you cannot break down the competence. If you cannot break down the competence, you cannot see Kalapa. At that time, Buddha teach to see space. For example, here you may see this is one hand. 
But if you can have only of that, you can see small holes, frontis holes, for the areas are coming up. At that day, when you see the whole body become transparent like ice block, at that day, you must focus to see space element, aka satati. It immediately already a day of the jhana stage. At that day, before they are practicing four elements meditation, every sitting they should re-establish their fourth jhana concentration. What is the reason? Fourth jhana, especially Anabana fourth jhana or white casino fourth jhana. That fourth jhana produces a strong, powerful, brilliant lights. With the assistance of that fourth jhana's light, if you try to penetrate four elements, you can easily understand four elements meditation. When you practice four elements meditation systematically, you, you can see this transparent body like as clock. Again, you must try to discern four elements and that ice block. You must concentrate on that four elements object. That concentrated mind on the four elements object also produces a strong, powerful light. That light is called the light of wisdom. With the assistance of the light of wisdom, if you penetrate to see space element, other than you can see space. As soon as you see space, then you can see clouds. United Kingdom and England, same meaning. <laughs> UK and England are the same meaning. So if you see clubbers, again you must get some four elements in each clubber. If you see four elements in each clubber, this is the last stage of Samatha. Last stage of Samatha as well as the beginning stage of Vipassana. Because of this reason, this four elements meditation is both side, Samatha and Vipassana. If you get the sample elements in each particular, each clapper, then you should continue to the sample. Color, odor, flavor, nutritive, essence, electricality, transparency, etc. You can easily get the sample these derivative materialities. Order dish, agasa, tattoo, space element. For clear understanding of these derivative materialities. So in some clubs there are eight types of materiality. I will calculate, eh? such as art element, water element, fire element, wind element, color, odor, flavor, and nutritive essence. In some clubs there are nine types of materiality, such as Art element, water element, fire element, wet element, color, water, flavor, nutritive essence, and light faculty. In some clubs, there are ten types of materiality such as art element, water element, fire element, wet element, color, odor, flavor, nutritive essence, light faculty, and Eye transparency. In the same way, you should understand ear transparency, nose transparency, tongue transparency, and body transparency. In some clubs, they are in the same way, ten types of material, but they are not transparent. They are open clubs. There are two important materialities, self-determining materiality and heart base. Heart base is my base for my consciousness. That heart base rise to be the own inside your heart. There is blood. To be the own that blood, this heart base rise. Another one is sesky dominating materiality. This clubber also spread throughout the body. Because of this reason, if you see one person, you can easily, easily distinguish this is man, this is woman. So they, this such determining materiality or septic clapper. Huh? This clapper also spread throughout the body everywhere. So all together there are di different types of derivative materialities. If you can 
analyze these calabas in this way. Other than that, only you can understand ultimate materiality. But nowadays there are many scientists. They do not understand about these calabas completely. What is the reason? In their laboratory, they can test only temperature bone materiality. According to Buddha's teaching, this group, if we divide this group as there are four groups. Number one is karma bone materiality. Number two is mind bone materiality. Number three is temperature bone materiality. Number four is nutrient bone materiality. Karma is connected with previous karma, no present karma. Present karma cannot produce present karma bone materiality. Present karma is, if there is any future existence, this is the cause for future material, future pet aggregates only. So, first karma produce present karma bone materiality. Because of this reason, Buddha teach second noble truth. The noble truth of the origin of Safari, Samuriya Sita. So, to understand this is karma bone materiality, we must try to discern five parts causes. But these five parts causes I will explain later. So, temporarily you should accept. Here, eye transparency. This eye transparency rise and say, I take it clapper. So, that I take it clapper, body take it clapper, ear take it clapper, nose take it clapper, tongue take it clapper, sack take it clapper, heart take it clapper. These clappers are produced by previous karma. Every consciousness, which tries to be the own heart base, can produce my bone materiality. So if you want to understand this is my bone materiality, number one, you must decide my consciousness which has to be the own your heart base. So without understanding heart base, without understanding my consciousness which arises to be the own heart base, you cannot discern my own materiality. Yeah, please try to see. Oh, Penny? Scratching. Which produce this penny? Which produce this scratching? You are mine. That mine is rice to penny on your heart place. That mine produce uncountable mind bone clapper. These clappers spread throughout the body. Up to this end, they also spread. So, if you analyze these clappers, in each clapper there are eight types of materiality. I will explain, repeat again. Earth element, water element, fire element, wind element, color, odor, flavor, and nutritive essence. Among these eight, there is wind element. That wind element again produces bodily intimation. That bodily intimation produces new calabas to rise different new new plates. Because of this bodily intimation, new new calabas always rising in passing way. The new calabas they cannot rise same place in the same place. They rise in different place. That different place rising is you may see this is Bene Sajay. But if you see clubbers, you cannot see this panga. You can see only clubbers. These clubbers, there are eight types. Among eight types, there is bodily intimation. That bodily, because of this bodily intimation, the whole, all robust, they do not rise in the same place. If you do not see this process, then we can say, you do not understand my poem materiality. Here is also another consciousness. Here, I consciousness. That I consciousness cannot produce my own materiality. 
In the same way, ear consciousness also cannot produce ear bomb, cannot produce mind bomb materiality. Nose consciousness also cannot produce mind bomb materiality. Tongue consciousness also cannot produce mind bomb materiality. Body consciousness also cannot produce mind bomb materiality. In the same way, you are praying. I want to tell about this. If you can do some four elements in your brain, you can see brain is nothing but a group of clubbers. Among those clubbers, one clubber is body decade clubber. Body. Body decade. <coughs> body decade clubber. Body tasker clubber. Body transparent. Body ah, transparent yes. clubber. In that body decade clubber, there is body transparency. The way they own body transparency, <coughs> Body consciousness can rise. Body consciousness knows only tangible object. Digital object? Tangible. Tangible. Tangible object. That body consciousness also cannot produce mind bomb materiality. What is crazy? They are very weak. They have no power to produce mind bomb materiality. Again, I want to explain another one. That body Transparent, depending on that body transparency in, in your brain, there are eight types of mentality, including body consciousness. Among, I will calculate, I will calculate this thing <laughs> because I have something to tell about yes. this problem. Yes. Hmm? Number one, body consciousness. Mm. Number two, yes. contact. Number three, feeling. Mm. This is neutral feeling. Mm. Uh, sorry, uh, happy feeling or painful feeling. Yes. Then number four is perception. Yes. Number five is collision. Yes. Number six is one pointedness. Number seven. Uh, number seven is life faculty. Mm. Number eight is attention. Yes, so all together, eight types, of, eight types of mentality is on. Among these eight types, there is no wisdom faculty. Mm. Wisdom faculty has to be on oh, your heart based on according to Bhagavad's teaching, but ah. you can get some practically. So, they are both inside your brain, there is no wisdom faculty. Yeah, okay, number two, number three is temperature bomb materiality. So now we have explained karma bomb materiality, number two, my bomb materiality, and now number three, Temperature bomb materiality. What is temperature? That fire element is called temperature. That temperature can produce new clubbers. For example, in your eye, there is eye target clubber together with eye transparency. If you analyze, there are 10 types of materiality. Among 10 types, there is fire element. That fire element can produce four or five generation new clubbers. This is temperature bomb materiality. In the same way, in your mind bomb clubber, there, if you analyze my, your mind bomb clubber, there are, in each clubber there are eight types of materiality. Above eight types there is fire element. That fire element also can produce new generation. But this mind power is very different. Ordinary mind, such as now you are talk, you are listening or I am talking, such type of mind, listening mind, cannot produce many clubbers. They have no much power. That mind can produce two or three generations only. In the same way, in that mind bomb, sorry, in that mind bone clubber, there is fire element. That fire element has no much power. That fire element can produce two or three generations only. 
However, if your mind is like Chana mind or Vipassana mind, that mind has strong power. That mind can produce uncountable millions of kalapas. Now many meditators, they can see like here, 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 etc. But what say. is that light? This is the light of Western. So how this arises? Hmm? You are discerning your breath or you are concentrating on your breath object or you are concentrating on your nimeta, anamana nimeta. If you can concentrate well, and if your concentration also becomes deeper and deeper, other than that, concentrate that mind associates with wisdom faculty. That wisdom faculty, when this wisdom faculty's power is very strong and powerful, then that mind can produce jhana mind, especially jhana mind, can produce strong powerful lights not only internally, but also externally. For example, if a meditator attain up to fourth jhana, hmm? that fourth jhana is superior mind. That superior mind can produce uncountable mind bone kalapas throughout the body. These kalapas spread throughout the body. Among those, if one analyzes those kalapas, in each kalapa there are eight types of materiality. Among eight types, there is color. That color begins luminous and bright. One kalabas color and another kalabas color rise very, very closely to each other. Because of this reason, if they cannot break down the compactness, they see light is continuous. Again, if you analyze those kalapas, in each kalapa there are eight types of materiality. Among eight types there is fire element. That fire element is called temperature. That temperature also produces uncountable many, many millions of kalapas. This, again, if you analyze these kalapas, in each kalapa they are also in the same way eight types of materiality. Among eight types, there is color. That color also luminous and bright. This temperature burn light, not only internally, but also up to externally spread. So, internal light is both, two. Two, main, two types. Two types is mind bone, color color, as well as temperature bone, color color. Two types of color color. But externally, there is only temperature bone, calabas color only. Depending on concentration, wisdom pagalagi's power is very strong. When concentration is very deep, wisdom pagalagi power also very great. When wisdom, the power of wisdom pagalagi is very great, then the light of wisdom is very bright. So, Three days, they do not understand this process of mind bone materiality as well as temperature bone materiality. Kama bone materiality has only internally, not externally. Mind bone materiality also has only internally, not externally. Because of this reason, they do not understand about Kama bone materiality and mind bone materiality. Why they do not rise in external in any way? Why? As soon as they rise, these clubs, my bone materiality, as well as kama bone materiality, as soon as they rise, they pass away very, very quickly. There is no time to carry from this body to laboratory. From this body to? Laboratory. Laboratory? Laboratory. 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 Laboratry. Three. Yeah. Laboratory. Three. Laboratory. Laboratory. Where they make experiments. Ah, laboratory. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Their lifespan is only 70 mm only. 70? Very short. Their lifespan is very short. So they cannot carry up to laboratory. 
In the same way, there is also another kalapa. Now every day we are eating. Food is inside our stomach. If a meditator gain the sun for animals and that newly eaten food, undigested hmm? food, they can see food is nothing but a group of kalapas. So if one analyzes these kalapas, in each kalapa they are a type same. Hmm? Water, fire, wind, color, water, flavor, and nutritive essence. Among these eight, there is new, number eight is nutritive essence. Throughout our body, there are life nonic clubs. Life nonic clubs. Among those life nonic clubs, there is fire element. That fire element is called digestive fire. When the digestive fire support this nutritive essence of newly eaten food, that nutritive essence can produce new generation, new clubs. But like no neck clubs arise only in this body, in this kind of internal body. So digestive fire is in our body only. In level 3, there is no digestive fire. <laughs> so because of this reason, they do not understand this nutritive as materiality. They can carry only one piece of flesh to the level 3. If we, if one meditator can descend this piece, huh, which they carry to level 3, this piece is a group of clubbers. If one analyzes these clubbers, in each clubber there are eight types of materiality such as earth, water, fire, wind, color, odor, flavor, and nutritive essence. What is the source? They are, are they permanent? No permanent. <coughs> they are also clubbers as soon as they rise, they pass away very, very quickly. But in each club, there is fire element. That fire element can produce new generation, new club. In that new generation, there is also again fire element. That fire element can produce another new generation. So, in any way, well, they can produce for a long time. In the same way. So, they are temperature bomb materiality only. They can test in their own laboratory this temperature of home materiality only. They cannot understand, especially in each club, there are eight types of materiality. Because their investigation is in a different way. My meaning is we Buddhists are very lucky. <laughs> we can, if we practice systematically, we can understand four types of materiality. Find your own direct knowledge. This is the materiality aggregate only. I cannot explain tonight about mentality. This is the object of vipassana. If you do not understand this materiality by your direct knowledge, if you practice vipassana, your vipassana is just superficial only. Do you want to practice superficial vipassana? <laughs> okay, please try. Okay, let us know. If you have any question. Ah, you have some much to your own children is some ice show. Well, to to put long to story short, he doesn't understand why the object we pasana is the first uh level tools and second level tools. This is the teaching of Buddha. Um, he understands there is a four element meditation among the four uh, subjects of Samatha meditation. And also there is a four element meditation Vipassana. So in the beginning stage of Vipassana. So what's the difference? The difference is they, if they see clubbers and they, if they can discern four elements, this is last stage of samatha form. This is their limitation. 
Then, if they understand four elements in each color, but this is the beginning stage of Vipassana, why? They understand ideally, materiality, this is first stage. First stage of Because four elements meditation, Buddha teach two ways, samatha meditation, meditation as Vipassana. So both, both sides Buddha teach. だから、サーデスエンゲオ、サマタスエンゴ。え、カーボンメンタルティスとかカーボンメテリアルティスとかね。Yes. In each club, there are weight, there is weight element. That weight element produces bodily intimation. Okay. So then the karma born mentality, or karma born materiality, when there's bodily, like if, because of weight? Yeah, if you analyze this, there are four types of materiality. Karma born materiality, mind born materiality, temperature born materiality, Nutritive as symbol materiality, four, four types. Among four types, one type is mind bone materiality. If you analyze this mind bone materiality, in each club there are eight types. Among eight types, there is one element. That one element produces bodily intimation. Because of this bodily intimation, four types of robots, mind bone, robot, karma bone, robot, temperature bone, robot, Nutrient boom, rupa. These all rupas, they do not rise in the same place. They rise different places. So the mind born or wind produced? To move only, to move other, to rise other different places. So it causes all of, all of them to reappear somewhere? Yes, yes. Even coming? Yes, because of the reason for there, you can come here. <laughs> this mind born, because of mind born, No, you can go back. This is my bone material. <laughs> <laughs> my bone material is carried of all the robots. Yeah. Uh, his question is, he heard from a Tibetan uh, monk, Prana. So he's asking, is Prana and Galapa are, are the same? I do not understand Tibetan monk. Okay. Tibet, what do you get He's asking if mindfulness is uh, Im important both for samatha and vipassana, or is it important for uh, samatha only? Both, both, and vipassana. Both, both, and vipassana. Both, both, and vipassana. Both, both, and vipassana. Both, both, Complete cessation of suffering. This is for realization of Nibbana. So if you want to practice Samatha, this noble eightfold path also necessary. If you want to practice Vipassana, this noble eightfold path also necessary. If you want to realize Nibbana, this noble eightfold path also necessary. Among noble eightfold path, Samasati is Remembering the meditation object repeatedly again, 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 again. If mindfulness is very strong and powerful, concentration will follow after mindfulness. Because of this reason, while practicing samatha, mindfulness is very important. For example, if you practice anapana, anapana speed meditation, You must always remember your meditation object. What is your meditation object? The breath is your meditation object. But occasionally you remember your meditation object. Sometimes you do not remember your meditation object. Then mindfulness is very weak. If mindfulness is very weak, concentration cannot arise. In the same way, when practicing Vipassana, 
Mindfulness is always remember, must remember the vipassana meditation object. What is vipassana meditation object? Our demon materiality, our demon mentality, and their causes. These are the object of vipassana. So, in meditator, sometimes he must contemplate our demon materiality as nature, impermanent, Dukkha, suffering, or another no self. Sometimes he must contemplate our deep mentality as a nature, impermanent, suffering, dukkha, and no self, another. So, Sati always must remember these objects. Sati is at the end, like hand. With hand, he put one object on another hand. The eye is like Vipassana wisdom. I investigate what this is. This is nature, or this is Dukkha, or this is Nata. <laughs> so this is similar to hand. Yes. Similar to this. Yeah. Hand. Hand. Yeah. Hand. Hand. Yeah. Hand. Yeah. Hand is similar to eye. 아, 위파사나 어, 지혜는 눈과, 가, 눈과 같다고 So, so what, there is one thing He carry this one in this way mm. And then I can see this is what mm. This is nature or this is Dukkha or this is mm. nature So, city mindfulness pick up the object of Vipassana Then, wisdom faculty investigate this object as nature or Dukkha or nature Therefore, one practice and vipassana also mindfulness is very important. Uh, when you see the light, you're not, you, you don't see it with your physical eye, but with your eye consciousness. This is especially the object of mind consciousness. But eye consciousness <laughs> also for some persons you can see, but very rare. Uh, can you explain the process a little more? Oh, which can I? This is which can I? Can no, rise no. up in the own heart face? Yeah, well, the, 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 for example, if they want to design an idol cognitive process, they must design an transparency in mind of idol and mind of both together. Then they must pay addition a group of small particles color. When color impinge both two, at the day, idol cognitive process rise. At the day, I consciousness also see this color because of the light of moisture. <coughs> Okay. Eye <laughs> consciousness also can see the color. Yes. Yes. Maybe color makes a group of small particles color. That color can see because of the assessment of the light of wisdom. But this is very rare opportunity. So. He is asking you to repeat uh, the, the, your, your explanation. You explain long after what you said. Maybe the light is can see by eye or by western eye. Mm. So both is possible. But western eye is very important. Western eye can penetrate through nature, such as nature, nature, or Dukkha nature or another nature. But eye consciousness can see only just color. Does not know this is nature or Dukkha or another. But the eye consciousness, one meditate, they close eye. But they can see the color. Why? Because of the existence of the light of wisdom.
For example, if they want to cancel, I do community process. Yes. They must cancel, I transparency, I do. And they might do. 만약에 우리가 이제 안문 인식 과정을 보려고 하면은 먼저 이눈 투명 요소를 분석하고 그다음에 이 마음의 그 심장 토대에서 일어나는 그 심장 토대를 분석해야 됩니다. Then they must cancel a group of color mask color. When color is being put to simultaneously at the day, I know cognitive process rise. At the day, I consciousness rise to be the own, I do. I transparency. That consciousness knows just color only. That I consciousness can see this color because of the light of wisdom. If there is no the light of wisdom, I consciousness cannot see. So because of this reason, I consciousness also can see just color only, but my wisdom I can see ultimate, this is ultimate materiality, this is ultimate mentality, this is nature, this is toka, this is nata, etc. In different ways, many ways they can, they can see. He's wondering, he read uh, the scriptures and he saw that in the First, second, and third jhana, Buddha didn't mention the importance of sati. But in the fourth, only in the fourth jhana, Buddha mentioned sati is important. All are important. All are important. There are thirty-four mental formations. These thirty-four mental formations are working together to produce first jhana, to produce second jhana, third jhana, and fourth jhana. So, in every jhana there is sati, my point is, this is universal. Universal in every wholesome dhamma as well as every wholesome resultant dhamma and every, especially higher functional consciousness. This is universal. Sati is universal. Yeah. All are important. 우리가 이제 그 반드시 사피가 같이 온다는 거죠. 아 예. 아 이제 시간이 많이 돼서 법회는 여기서 마치기로 하겠습니다. 오케이. 시아링 마리. 이담이 봉야. 이담이 봉야. 아소야 케야. 아소야 케야. 오하 호주. 이담이 봉야. 이 밤이 보냐 이 밤이 보냐 이 밤이 보냐 이